How's it going guys? My name is TJP and welcome back to another NHL 22 franchise rebuild. In today's rebuild, we got the Washington Capitals. Washington Capitals. So if you guys are in the content, make sure to like and subscribe. Comment down below video, check out my shows down in the description. This is a playlist containing other NHL 22 content. And uh share my channel if you guys are liking my channel. I'm a little out of breath because I just took one on a nice little walk. Walked my dog, ran back in the house. <laughs> yeah, so because it was cold. So yeah, uh Hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's get on to the gameplay. All right, guys. So let's take a look at this roster we got here with the Washington Capitals. So uh, we've got Ovechkin, Carlson, Backstrom, uh, Kuznetsov, uh, Oshi. We got some. We got some. We got some talent on this team. Uh, it does dip a little bit, but um, it is there. Th this team. I've seen what we could do. I've seen this team win. I mean, Ovechkin having Ovechkin is a pretty. Pretty, pretty nice. He's pretty nice to have on the team. So, doesn't matter how old he is. That guy gets goals. He scores. So, um, yeah, legendary. Legend, legend, legend. So, let's take a look at this team right here. And, well, the lines. We don't have much cap, but I want to make one move, maybe. Uh, and that is to get... I'm on the wrong team because I picked the, I did the wrong thing. So let me go to edit. I thought I went I went to edit lines, right? Okay, maybe I didn't. Wait, 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 now I go to edit lines. I kind of want to get I want to improve this line down here. Um. Yeah, maybe a better center, maybe a better uh, winger. But um, other than that, I think the team is pretty solid. I mean, we gotta get another left defenseman. I mean. Having John Carlson is pretty huge because he is pretty good right defense and not a lot of good ones out there. But maybe we get better left now. I mean, maybe Martin can improve into something good, but uh, I'm going to see if there's any trades out there, small trades, so we can get a good center on the team, and I will see you guys once we make a trade. All right, trade away three first-round picks, a second and a third-round pick to the Ottawa Centers. Are we going to trade for Tim Stutzel? Uh, he's, I, he's one of the guys I like to trade for. He's cheap, he's young, and he's pretty good. So... Yeah, Tim Stutzel, welcome to the team. And now, uh, looking at the squad, uh, Tim Stutzel's actually playing left, left winger. Okay, I don't know if I, do I like that? I, I guess, I guess I do. Uh, I want to. I feel like there's a way I can improve this some way somehow. Uh. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Maybe not. I guess I'll just do best lines. We'll go with that. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be the team. I'll see you guys at the midway point in February, and we'll see how the team is doing then. We're in February. Got off to a very slow start, and because of that, we only have 52 points, and we're 25, 24, and 2. So we're really not doing that great right now, uh, but we are in the hunt. Uh, but we need to do better in the second half of the season. Uh, I don't know why we got off to such a terrible start, but we did. Uh, Ovechkin has 61 points already, so you know this guy is scoring goals. 33 goals, 20 assists already. He's he's playing really good. Nicholas uh, Backstrom, he's doing pretty good. Carlson, he's playing his defense out there. He's trying his best. Uh, Mantha, TJ Oshie. I mean, <sighs> Stutzel's okay. I didn't really make that. I only made one trade. I mean, team is pretty much other than that. I mean, there was like a call down. But pretty much the same. So, I don't know. I feel like we're just kind of trying. I forgot to show you guys the goalies. That's another thing I forgot to show you guys in the, uh, in the, in the, in the, in the showing the team. I completely forgot about showing you guys the goalies. But let's take a look at them. So, we have Elos Samsonov. Uh, Samsonov, I should, I should say. So, he's decent. And then we got the Tech... Uh, Vanacek. It's actually pretty good. Vanacek. Vanacek. I think I'm hopefully I'm pronouncing it right. Uh, Vitek. Technicality. Technically. Okay. Technologically. All right. I'm going to stop. So, yeah. We need to kind of just pick it up in this second half of the year. Um, so, hopefully we could do that. Um, I Like I said, I'm kind of cap struck right now. I'm kind of curious to see who is going to be a free agent. Because maybe we just... Uh, offer some guys money now i believe this is 
where our free agents are, correct? Yeah, 2022, 2023. So Schultz, uh, I'd like to keep him around. Uh, Chelowski, like to keep him around. Um, yeah, okay. So there's, there's some guys here. All right, I'm gonna see if I can, uh, if I want to extend anybody right now, and uh, I'll see you guys in the end of the year. All right, guys. So end of the season, we ended up making the playoffs and retaining on Carolina in the first round. So yeah, we were only we were four and four thirty five and three. So we did do a little bit better in the second half of the year, but uh, not much, not much better. I mean, Ovechkin had 105 points, so this guy was ridiculous. Uh, Backstrom had 92, so he was really good. Uh, Kuznetsov at 73, 73 for Carlson. Mantha had 67. I mean, you guys did. The team was pretty solid. Uh, we did re-sign Schultz. Um, Justin Schultz. Kind of gave him a little bit too much money, I feel like. I don't know, for the production. But, you know what? I feel like right defensemen are hard to come by, so... Uh, yet... Uh, I feel like we did pretty good. We also had a couple injuries, so that also could have contributed to why the record wasn't really that as great as it would have been. But you're looking at the hits, blocks, giveaways, takeaways. Looks pretty solid for the most part. You guys can see the stats. Um, and uh, goalies. Yeah, Samsonov and uh, Vanacek. Okay. Could have been a little bit better there, but guys. Could have been a little bit better. But uh, curious to see. We scored a lot of goals. We scored probably the most goals in the intro. We had 90, only 91 points, but we scored. We probably scored some of the most goal, probably the most goals. I I would think, but maybe our defense was kind of near the bottom. Let's see. Yeah, most goals we scored, and our defense was actually not terrible. Well, it wasn't great, but I don't know if it says 90. If that says screams 91 points, I don't know. But here's the playoff tree in case you guys are curious. Give me a pause and take a look. So, can we win in round number one against the Carolina Hurricanes? That remains to be seen. But we're going to simulate. So, game one against Carolina. Let's see what can happen here. Game one, we win 7-2. to Nice. Can we win game two? We lose 6-2. to Game three, we win 6-5. Okay. Game four, we lose in overtime 3-2. to So, now it's best of three. We lose game five. We need to force game seven. And we don't. So we lose in six in the first round in the first season. Love it. So uh, I'll see you guys at the end of the year. See you when Stanley Cup. How about that? Seattle Kraken in their first season win uh, the Stanley Cup. Okay, game. Okay. Imagine that happens in real life. I don't know. You never know. You really never know till it's over. But yeah, I don't. I I wouldn't. I wouldn't put my money on the Kraken winning. Uh, the Stanley Cup, but you never know. You, know, you really never know. You, you, you know. <laughs> That'd be incredible if they do. But either way, let's take a look at the individual rewards. Uh, so we had Ovechkin, Art Ross Trophy. He also got the Maurice Richard Trophy. So that's solid. Um, any other trophies? Carlson. Uh... He won uh, Grace All Around Ability, his position. So, had a lot of individual awards, but couldn't get the biggest award of them all. So, let's go on to the offseason. Second, third round pick, and uh, Axel Johnson Fjalby to the Sharks. And I traded for Evander Kane. I wanted to get another left winger. He is making a lot of money, but I think this is a quality player that we're trading for. So, um, there we go. Big trade of the draft. And uh, we're just going to sim to the end of the draft. And uh, I don't remember if we had a lot of people that were up for free agency anyway this season. So I guess trading for Kane isn't too big of a deal. Um, and I think a lot of our guys are just on qualifiers. So let's go on to that re-sign phase and just double check in case I'm not crazy. I know I have a few guys that are qualifying, but it should be too much. Uh, yeah, we don't have a lot of money. But good news is, is that most of my guys here are going to probably accept the qualifier anyway. Uh, in terms of goalies, let's just double check. Ooh, Samsonov and Van Vanisek. Okay. Uh, maybe we want to keep them. So we'll qualify them. And we'll also we'll also offer Copley a contract too. Um, I don't know if he'll actually get any ice time, but we'll give him a $1.535 million deal, Phoenix Copley. So uh, in terms of other, everyone else, 
Um, I guess I'm gonna have to let Kempney walk, uh, which is not that big of a deal. I feel like getting finding left defenseman shouldn't be too bad, and also we should be okay. And then yeah, really most of my team. I mean Irwin, okay, he's gonna be walking, but yeah, I'm just gonna do this, and I'll see you guys maybe at free agency, but maybe we'll pick up like a guy in uh, free agency, but nothing too major. All right, so I did resign Phoenix Copley, which is kind of neat. And uh, we're going to get all these guys on qualifier, so we're going to head on into free agency now. All right, small little signing here. Probably not going to play in the NHL, but we picked up Dennis Yan. Because uh, I wanted a little bit more left wingers. Uh, I guess that's organizational depth for left winger, so I'll take it. Okay, so at the start of season two, let's take a look at the roster that we have so far on the team. So we've got uh, Ovechkin, Carlson, Backstrom, all at 90 above or better. So that's pretty good. Kuznetsov is pretty good. Stutzel's up to an 87. I've uh, got TJ over here at 86. Kane at 85. I mean, I think we got a little bit better, but we did lose some of our depth. A little bit of our depth, but I, it, I don't think it's too bad. Uh, a lot, some of the guys didn't re-sign. Uh, and taking a look at the goalies, I think we kind of went down a little bit. Uh, Samsonov went over to 86. I got Copley as our backup, which isn't too bad. So Vanacek did not accept qualifier. So... If I view contracts, I am curious to see who we have in the system. Uh, so, uh, Chelowski did not accept his qualifier, uh, but we're going to see if he'll take 0.75 million. If not, then we're going to probably trade Dennis. And then, uh, in terms of goalkeeping, uh, Vanisek, we're going to give him a uh, contract as well. But if he doesn't accept it, we're going to just package them to in a first round pick maybe try to get someone a little bit better for our team that might help us out maybe get another maybe even like another goalie or something so i'm gonna simulate and i'll see you guys either when i make a trade or in february you guys in february currently 30 14 6 at 66 total points which is pretty solid uh so only point behind the philadelphia flyers in our division so we're playing pretty well and i want to take a look at these stats and Possibly muster up a trade. So we got back from leading my team at 52 points. So that's pretty sweet. So he's playing well. Vetchkin's playing pretty well. Carlson. You guys see the team's looking pretty solid. Um, we had a couple guys miss a few games here and there, there. But for the most part, I think we've been pretty healthy. And then some of these guys down here just don't really play that much. So hits, blocks, giveaways, takeaways. How are we looking on these? Not terrible, if I'd say so myself. Not looking too bad so far. 92 hits for my boy Oshi, and 102 for Ovechkin. Yeah, that's what we like to see, baby. Ooh, I wanted to show you guys the goalie stats. So let's do that. Goalies. Uh, Samsonov's doing okay. Copley is a backup. He's playing very well. Love to see that. Copley, Cop Copley, 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 Copley. He's playing really well. That's all I'm going to say. All right. So, I want to make a trade because, you know, Vanacek and then, uh, uh, Cho uh, Dennis, uh, they're not really playing. Chelowski, he's not playing. So, I want to see if there's a trade I can make for them. Right away, <coughs> uh, Chelowski... Uh, Vanacek and uh, LaPierre picks, and I traded for uh, <clears throat> I traded for uh, Bouchard and uh, Bolu. So Evan Bouchard and Bolu are coming on to the team. So there you go. Um, does it make us much better? Maybe. Defensively, I think our right side is actually really good. This is like the first time where I'm like lacking on the left side. Um, but uh, yeah, the team is looking pretty... Honestly, I think this team's going to be pretty good. I'm going to simulate to the end of the year. No, if I make a move before then, you'll see. Otherwise, see you guys at the end of the year. So, end of the season, and we did make the playoffs. And we're taking on the Tampa Bay Lightning in the first round of the playoffs. So, we were 46-28-8. Which leads to a total of 100 points, if I'm not mistaken. Not terrible. Not too bad. Uh, if we take a look at the stats. Yeah, 100 points. Won our division. Which is pretty neat. Um, and uh, I think the defense is a little bit better. We didn't score as much this year, but we had better defense. 
And we were the seventh best team in the league. The Panthers were number one, man. Those damn Panthers, man. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Hopefully I can do, do well with them, but... I don't know. Knowing EA, knowing EA, you know? And he doesn't like me. Anyways, uh, you guys can see the stats. I think we did pretty good this season. Um, I mean, you guys are looking at the numbers. I'd say for the most part, pretty solid. Pretty solid looking at the point totals and if we look at the hits, blocks, giveaways, takeaways. Those seem to be pretty solid. I mean, you guys see the rest of the stats. You guys want to pause, take a look. Um, I am curious to see uh, who's up for free agency because that could be big for next year uh, in determining what how we're going to do. So, goalkeeping wasn't bad. Uh, Copley had a terrible second half of the year, though. Uh, but Samson off was decent. Uh, but either way, still, nevertheless, I think we did pretty good. And we, like I said, we're taking on the Lightning. So you guys see the playoff tree. Pause, take a look. So 100 points. Seventh best team in the NHL. Not that it really means much. So here we go. Tampa Bay. Game one against the Bay of Tampa. I'm kidding. Game one, we lose 6-2. to two. I deserve the loss after I said that. Game two, we win. Okay. Can we win game three? We don't. We lose in overtime. So we're down 2-1. We go down 3-1, so we're probably going to lose in 5, right? Yes. Wow, I just predicted it. I can predict when I lose. It's amazing. Like, I knew I was going to lose. Like, I, I just knew. Just knew it. Called it. So that was kind of terrible. So we kind of had a terrible season. Terrible letdown in the playoffs. And, yeah, we need to somehow get better. Panthers are the best record, and they lost to the Wings. <laughs> Makes a lot of sense, right? All right, well, I'll see you guys at the end of the year. Third and final season underway. The Flyers won the Stanley Cup. Okay. Uh, good for them, I guess. Um, let's take a look at the awards. Uh, even if we won any awards, who cares? I don't think we did this year. I think we probably didn't get any. I would assume not. But, uh, we'll look. Yep, I don't see any capitals here. Nope, no capitals to be found in sight. Which is unfortunate. So, I guess we're just gonna have to, uh, go on to our third and final season. I traded away a first and four seconds for Mackenzie Blackwood and Fabian Zetterlin from the Devils. Uh, traded for a quality goalkeeper and um, I guess just like another right winger for the depth. So, cool. So, these are the picks. Um, again, they're not going to see the light of Danny and Child. So, we're going to the re-sign phase. This is where it kind of gets kind of fun because I think I have some free agents that I might need to re-sign. I'm pretty sure Mackenzie is a restricted free agent. Right, game? Yes, he is. But it's all good because we're going to keep him anyway. Uh, in terms of our other skaters, uh, Stutzel. Oh, God. Okay, this should be fun. I mean, we really don't have any good unrestricted region guys, personally. So we're probably going to have to lose out on... Eller, maybe. I don't know. I'm going to offer some guys some contracts, and I'll see you guys once I'm done. We signed Evan Bouchard, Mackenzie Blackwood, Tim Stutzel, and, uh, well, Isla Samsonov said he wanted to re-sign, but I don't have enough money. So, hmm, not going to be able to re- Wait, 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 what? How do I not have enough money? Qualifier. How can I only offer him that much? That's some bullshit, game. That really is some bullshit. We'll qualify him, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to get him back. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get him back, but we qualified him. Um, if I can, I guess I'll just sign a backup goalie, but that's kind of annoying. I wanted to have like a stud goalie lineup, and I can't do that. So, I guess we can give Eller a contract, maybe. He wasn't on that much money, so we'll give him 1.9 million. I'm fine with that, Lars Eller. And then I guess we'll throw Orlov a contract. Hmm. Give him like a one year deal. 2.15. He might accept that. Uh, Shiri, give him a contract. 1.375. Connor Shiri. And um, I guess Rhymes Dick, sure. Yeah, he doesn't want that much, so we'll give him that too. Trevor Rhymes Dick. Okay. So yeah, um, I guess we're going to have to lose out on Vanitech. It's not that big of a deal. Or no, not Vanitech. Uh, Samsonov. Yeah. But uh, it's kind of annoying. Uh, well, Orlov can't resign him. 
Uh, I'm going to reject this offer. Connor Sheary rejected. So why can't I afford contracts? Weird. Okay, I'm just going to simulate the free agency, and I'll figure out what I'm doing once I get there. I'm going to Clark and Dowd for uh, Giovanni Smith. More of a salary cap dump, or a slight salary cap dump, but uh, I also need the left wingers, so sure, do that trade. Traded three, four third round picks and a first round pick for uh, Ingram, uh, Giannot, and Heinen. So there you go. That is what I did. I, I don't think I'm going to be able to sign. Uh, um, uh, Samsonov back, so I kind of just needed to make some trades. If I can get him back, I can get him back. If I can, I can. But I'm going to see if there's any left wingers out there that I can afford because I still need a couple more. So probably just going to end up doing that instead. All right, I picked up Miles Wood in free agency. Need another left winger, so we got him. So Gabriel Fortier did not accept my contract, but I did offer one to Jonathan Bernier, and he went to the Lightning as well. That's really annoying. How about Sheary, which is kind of cool, Connor Sheary. And then we've got Keith Kincaid to round out the team. So that's the last one I'm going to make, guys. Then I'll see you guys start the third and final season. All right, guys. So third and final season, this is this team we're going to be rocking with. So we've got uh, Ovechkin, Backstrom, Carlson, <coughs> Kuznetsov, Stutzel, Wilson, Mantha, Buchar, Kane, Johansson. I mean, you guys can see there's some talent on this team. Uh, but it does uh, dip a little bit. We do need some better left defensemen. Uh, so maybe at around the deadline or before the deadline, I might have to trade away Samsonov and a couple other restricted guys, maybe a couple picks, and try to get like a better left defenseman. So maybe we'll do that. Uh, looking at the goalies, though. I mean, Blackwood and Kincaid isn't terrible. It's not too bad, but yeah, it's. I guess it'll get the job done if you take a look at the lines. And you guys will see what I'm talking about here. So I think the offense looks, for the most part, pretty solid. Um, it's, it's not too bad. And then the defense, it's kind of meh. Especially on this side. Um, maybe we try to get like another left defenseman. Uh, that'd make me a little bit happier. I mean, they're young, so. But even then, just. I would like. Just a little better but left defenseman. So maybe we look for a trade now, actually. Because I don't think Samson is going to accept a contract. I mean, if he did, that'd be great. But he, I don't see that happening personally. So. Uh, how much money do I have? Not a lot. So, yeah, he's, uh, you know, restricted and in the system. No one else here is, uh, here. So that's good. Okay. Yes, yeah, so I think I'm going to trade Samsonov right now, and, uh, then we'll start off the season. Overpay, but I traded away Samsonov, two first and two seconds for, uh, Daniel Cheka. So... Um, that's kind of just improved the defense, so I think that'll help us out a little bit there. So, now I had to wait Trace Hansen off, but he wasn't really going to play. And I know it was an overpay, but hopefully it's not too big of a deal. I'll see you guys at the trade deadline or near the trade deadline in February. Hopefully we're pretty good. Alright, I'm going to just trade with the Carolina Hurricanes. So I'm going to trade away my fourth seventh round pick, and we're going to pick up, uh, Demers. So, I mean, Jason Demers other defensemen to have on on our organization and i mean i'm not going to use these picks anyway so might as well do this trade guys yeah, so we're in february and we're currently 24 22 and 3 which isn't amazing but we are currently third ranked which isn't bad we decided in december yeah we didn't want to win any games <laughs> we wanted to go on like an eight game losing streak uh so that kind of hurt our standings a little bit but uh, so far, if you're looking at the stats, Ovechkin with 51 points leading the team. Uh, then Kuznetsov, uh, Oshi, TJ Oshi is doing pretty good. Carlson. I'm trying to think if we've got any injuries. I mean, Kane has hurt for a few games. Uh, McMichael missed a few games. But I think for the most part, everyone's been relatively healthy ish. Uh, and yeah, just looking at the numbers here, it's not bad. Not. What I'm looking at is not terrible. Um, you guys can see the hits, the blocks, the ways takeaway. We're doing okay, but I feel like we'd be doing better. I do feel like we could be playing a little bit better. Let's take a look at those goalies. Blackwood's playing okay. Ingram is not doing that well. Hmm. Kind of struggling a little bit. 
he's kind of struggling. But uh, Blackwood's playing well. Uh, so he's, well, he's playing okay. He's playing pretty good. So 24-22-3. I, I mean, I don't really have any cap space. I made all the moves. Made a trade already. Unless there's another trade that pops up that I want to make, then I'll make it. Otherwise, I'm just going to keep the team the way it is. So if I don't make a trade, I'll see you guys at the end of the season where hopefully we come on a nice run and can actually get to the first round this season. I'm going to do this deal with the Canadians' fourth fifth round pick. We're going to trade for Ole, 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 Ole in the sixth and the seventh. Like Xavier Ole. Hopefully I pronounced that correctly. Just some uh, defenseman organizational depth. We will take it. Okay, right, so I think we're at the end of the season. And I'm looking at it. I think we just slipped into the playoffs. I mean, our division was very bad. <laughs> looking at it. 91 points total. Yeah, our division was kind of trash. Uh, we're the second lowest point total team that made the playoffs. Predators are the lowest. But let's see what we're taking on. Because I think we made the playoffs. I'm pretty sure we did. We did. And we're taking on Toronto. Cute. Very cute. Toronto in the first round. Love to see it. And they were 52, 24, and 6. So, yeah. At least we made the playoffs every season. But, yeah, this year wasn't really that good. Um, definitely a downgrade. Yeah, we didn't play that well. And just looking at the stats, I mean, I don't know what it is. I, I, I'm looking at it, and I, maybe just the fit wasn't white. I, I don't know. I mean, just upsetting, upsetting. But I can't be that upset because, again, we made the playoffs. So maybe we're going to run. You never know with EA and just you got to play the games. So, let's take a look at those goalie stats. Black was pretty decent. And, um, just get to see the team stats. Yeah, we didn't really score that. We're really not scoring that much. We're kind of like a middle-of-the-pack team. We really are middle-of-the-pack. Um, trying to have the most points in the, in the entire NHL. And we're taking them on. What a, what a disaster. Okay. Well, let's see if we can beat Toronto. You never know. You really never know. Game one against Toronto. Maple Leafs versus the Capitals. Game one. Let's simulate. We win game one. Cool. Can we win game two? No, we lose game two. Can we win game three? We lose game three. Game four? We lose in overtime. And game five? We lose in overtime. So here's the funny thing. The CPU teams can beat the best teams. If I'm the best team, the CPU beats me. But if I'm not that good and the CPU is good, they beat me. Weird. Very odd. Okay. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we got eliminated in the first round every single season. And there really wasn't much I could do about it. Well, I guess we'll just simulate to the end of the year and probably see who wins the Stanley Cup. Maybe the Maple Leafs. Maybe not. Kind of won the Stanley Cup. I also saw that the freaking Predators, who had the who had a worse record than us, and then making the Conference Finals. Or I don't think they got to the Conference Finals. They got to the Eastern Semifinals, or whatever it was. They got to the Semifinals. It just doesn't make any sense. <laughs> okay. Awards. Probably didn't get any. And even if we did, I don't care. Oh, we did. Chica got the Bill Masterton Memorial Trophy because he was a great sport. Do I care? Nope, because that didn't help me win a Stanley Cup. So that is going to be it for me. I will see you guys in the outro. That'll be it for me. If you guys enjoyed the content, leave a like on the video and subscribe. If you are not subscribed, let me know in the comments on what other videos you want to see. We've got the Panthers in the next NHL rebuild, so... Yeah, like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments below some more video ideas. Check my socials while you were down there commenting. There's order in the description. We got a playlist containing other NHL 22 content in the description. Got my channel as well. Go subscribe if you're not subscribed. And just check out some other videos from me. And recommend me some games if you guys want to. I mean, down for that. You can throw it in the Discord. Throw it in the comments. You know, works for me. Tweet them at me. Reddit. <laughs> Put them anywhere. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Take care. Have a great night. See you soon. And peace.